the height on the bounce tells it's on the spare eight. Then a chance for Jonathan. Jonathan in there's a tough one. Yes! Oh, Jonathan! Seven minutes gone. The perfect start for Scotland. Boris Johnson celebrating his ninth goal for his country. And a dreadful error in defence from Cyprus. But Johnson wasted no time in taking immediately by that. Superb finish, an error in defence. Here's Johnston going through. And Sokka is trying to get back. Johnston taking the ball and drop. Pangeres got a hand to it. Couldn't keep it out. So Savide is turning for Cyprus. Here's Nicolau going forward. For the Andres putting pressure on David Neri. Crowded goal goalmouth now, as Savide plays the corner in, up goes Leighton, he's in trouble, Chris is there, it was blocked there by Leighton, a lot of chance for the Zipriots, there's a chance to get a strip for it. before either away team could score. Scotland certainly managed early on there, Speedy. Chance for Johnston, back to Goff. And Goff has equalised! Richard Goff for Scotland! A, a vital recovery! And Scotland are right back on terms as Richard Goff with his fourth goal for his country. The Cypriots have a debate among themselves with how that came about, but it came from the throw from Brian McClare. It was helped on there by Paul McStay. That was good work here from Speedy playing it across. I then watch more chance the way he sets this up for Richard Goff in a better shooting position. Goff waiting with great composure and driving that beyond the keeper for Scotland's equaliser. Forward quickly. Richard Goff's already there. Alan McInally another target. And it'll be played in from the far side. By Roy Aiken. And there's a hit! Scotland has scored! We've had five and a half minutes of time added on. Richard Goff has done it! Right at the cross, Jumblies and Mitchell on the halfway line. And you can be sure there will be a major inquest now into the other time added on by referee Cushion. Richard Goff with his second goal of the match. Let's table this ball again as the ball is played in by Roy Aiken. A prodigious leap, a powerful header by Goff. And Scotland have won the match surely now in the most dramatic fashion.